Hello and welcome to day two of Friends of the Earth Conference 2012 where today we're welcoming 500 people to the conference and they're in for a surprise because we've got inspirational speakers such as Caroline Lucas and Vivian Westwood. Brilliant. Andy Atkins got the day off to a start with a speech saying how we all need to see things differently. Then it was time for our first session which featured Mel Evans from Platform. She spoke about how the Heathrow campaign was won by different types of non-governmental organisations coming together and how she's trying to stop big oil companies such as BP sponsoring art events. Links that we can make between different um, strands of social movements. And we also heard from Neil Kingsnorth, who is the head of activism at Friends of the Earth. He said that the real change doesn't come from those in power, and he reminded us that it's all about the people. We are the raw materials. Work out how to do it, and you know, there's that lovely quote from Einstein that the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over. And finally, we heard from Caroline Lucas, who is the Green MP for Brighton Pavilion. She said that the fact that we're all here some 40 years after we were formed shows that we have failed on some level and that we need to reach out more widely. Then after lunch there were too many sessions to choose from but I settled on one entitled Our Environment, Our Rights and this featured Eve McNamara who is a campaigner against fracking, Nick Rao who is a Paraguay campaigner at Friends of the Earth and Haf Elgar from Friends of the Earth Cymru who is fighting against incinerators in some of the most deprived areas of Wales. Then there were some networking sessions and other activities so I decided to try my hand at making a bag from some of the old campaign materials. And the final set of speeches for this evening was the real highlight with thoughts and opinions offered by Executive Director of Friends of the Earth, Andy Atkins. There were solar panels on the roof of that warehouse over there. And suddenly I'm painting an architect's picture of a new world in my own head. Now that may need some treatment. Britain's first ever Green MP, Caroline Lucas. And we learnt about the front line of the climate emergency from Lindy Nakpil, who is from the Freedom From Debt Coalition in the Philippines. And finally from fashion designer Vivian Westwood, who gave us a great quote. There are only two types of people left in the world, eco-warriors and idiots. And we finished off the evening with music from John Chigley, poetry from Danny Chivers and a disco that went into the early hours. So that's it from day two of Friends of the Earth Conference 2012. Don't forget, if you want to follow all the action, make sure you get on Twitter, follow me, at Adam Roxby, and don't forget to use the hashtag F-O-E-C-O-N-F, that's FOCONF, and we'll see you again tomorrow for the last day of conference.